guys! Kumusta po ang bawat isa? I hope that you all guys safe and sound and I hope that you all guys are uh, having a good day. So tonight or today guys, I'm going to show you how to prepare or how to, how to cook a uh, honey garlic chicken. Ayan, it's very easy, it's very simple. Ayan, there's are two ways of, uh, of preparing it or cooking a honey garlic chicken. You can put in an oven or you can cook in a pan or in a pot as it is in a slow heat so and guys so first and foremost let me show you all the ingredients that we needed and it's very easy and it's very simple and and all the ingredients that we needed is very accessible uh, in the market so and guys of course we need uh, some um garlic powder and as you can see guys right here we have a garlic powder pepper garlic salt soy sauce and it's it just right here guys and then of course we need vinegar fresh garlic honey chicken of course uh you can use a chicken breast for those who really watching for their calorie or you can use chicken thigh as well or the chicken leg of course and we need as well guys a chicken broth chicken broth guys is uh it's all your choice you can put a chicken broth or you can just add water to make um to add more water in the chicken to make it more tender. So, ayan guys, please stay with me. Ayan, samahan niyo po ako. And I hope that you will like and I hope that you will learn from too in this video. So, ayan guys, right now we're going to start to marinate the chicken. Ayan, uh, we need to put the pepper and garlic salt uh, to marinate the chicken. And of course, along with the garlic powder. So, ayan guys, yung ating unang gagawin, we have to marinate and mix well properly the garlic powder, the garlic salt, and the pepper into the chicken. And then we have to keep aside for like 30 minutes. Ayan. Para sa ganun guys, matanggal ng konti yung kanyang lansa. But again guys, it depends how we prepare or how you want to do it your chicken but for me i want it first to be marinated with the garlic powder garlic salt and the pepper so yeah guys right now we're going to cook the chicken so i put on the stove earlier so the pan is already ready ayan po and guys as you can see ayan uh, while i'm putting all the chicken in the frying pan you can't see any oil Ayan. And as you can see earlier in the, as I mentioned, or as I showed you all the ingredients that we needed earlier, uh, you can't see any oil from it because as you can see guys, there's a skin on in the chicken. So the oil from the chicken, yun po yung gagamitin natin to fry or to sear the chicken. So ayan po uh, guys, so kailangan natin lang ay isi-sear natin yung chicken for um like two to three minutes or both sides until until it lightly brown ayan po so as you can see as well guys later on i i use two ways first i seared the chicken in the frying pan and then i baked it but anyway guys i'm going to show you bits by bits so for now ito po yung ating gagawin kailangan lang po natin iseared yung chicken para mas maganda po at mas mag absorb po yung garlic powder yung pepper and yung garlic salt ayan and as you can see guys if you going to try it the smell is really really good it's so garlicky but it's so yummy and then while we seared it the chicken in the pan uh, we're going to mix everything in guys so the honey the soy sauce the vinegar and of course yung ating garlic later on we're just going to drop it in, in the chicken so yun guys we need to properly mix all the liquid ingredients and then later on guys we're going to pour in as well in the chicken so yeah and guys the the honey that i use it is a pure honey and it's a hundred percent pure honey so as you can see the color is quite really different ayan po but you know if you don't have that kind of honey pwede po kayong gumamit ng clear honey anyway any kind of honey it's totally fine so and guys you just need to mix it properly so all the liquids uh ingredients it mix well ayan po so cheers guys ayan um let's all do the cooking and i hope you're still enjoying it and now we're going to flip the chicken guys and uh, let's check if the the other side is already brown so there as you can see it's already lightly brown so yeah that's the way we're gonna see it so as i mentioned earlier we don't need any oil for the chicken guys because it creates a, a oil from it 
because of uh, the skin on and as you all know guys the chicken especially in the thigh part or in the thigh area is a bit fatty that's why some other people they use um chicken breast and chicken breast po yung ginagamit nila but of course for for us mas gugustuhin natin yung my content fats because we are not in diet right now we're going to add the fresh garlic so ayan guys so as you can see we add or we use too much garlic ayan honey garlic chicken talaga siya but it's apology is a quit a little bit burn but later on guys honestly i go i'm going to take it off the skin uh, i just use the skin to get uh, some oil from it ayan but yeah as you can see later guys um uh, mawawala po yung skin niya yun nga lang po um uh, at the last part of the video, I didn't show up already how I take off the skin. Ayan po. So, ayan guys, uh, we just a little bit fry yung ating uh, garlic. Ayan, at ayan po natin to bring more aroma. Ayan, sa ating uh, chicken. Mas mabango po siya kung a little bit brown. Ayan. Medyo a little bit brown lang po yung chicken. Yung, uh, no, sorry, yung ating garlic. Para sa ganun po ay mas mabango uh, siya sa ating ano, ulam, ayan, sa ating dish. And then, isunod naman natin, guys, of course, syempre, ilalagay na natin yung ating mga liquid ingredients. Ayan. As you can see, diba, um, I mix it well properly earlier dahil sa yung honey is a uh, very thick it chicken masyado siya ayan very pure yung honey na ginamit natin as but as i mentioned earlier you can use the clear honey ayan mayroon pong clear honey always by the shelves in the market so ayan guys uh, at atin lang po siyang papakulo and of course and then we let the chicken to absorbs all the um ingredients or all the um spices not spices uh all the liquids ingredients that we add in earlier ayan para ma mas um lumasa kumbaga is papasok sa pinakaloblob ng chicken i'm sorry pinakaloblob ayan um yung ano yung ingredients na inilagay natin so ayan guys uh we just let it there to uh, simmer or boiled it a little bit. And of course, kailangan din po na medyo i-turn-turn natin siya ng konti dahil medyo na-burn ko po siya kanina. And it's apology for that. But I I do hope that you're gonna learn from it, guys. So, ayan lang po siya, guys. Uh, we just need to flip in. And then, so the... Uh, all the ingredients will be absorbed by the chicken. So, ayan po siya. So, ayan, we just keep it in the side and simmer it for a while. So, ayan siya guys. So, right now, we're going to add as well the chicken broth. So, ayan na siya guys. Uh, we almost done. Malapit nang matapos. So, after all the, some of the liquid ingredients earlier, the very last thing that we add in, okay, so, is the chicken broth. And then, we put the lid on and then we're going to simmer it again. So, guys, as I mentioned it earlier, ayan, uh, you can, if you don't have oven at home, you can use or you can cook the honey garlic chicken only in the pot or in a pan. Ayan. Um, we're going to cook it slowly. Ayan. Because of the honey, it's, it's so easy to burn. Ayan. Yung chicken po ay madali siyang maburn. So, what I did guys, uh, I just simmered it a little bit in the frying pan as you can see. And then I just keep it flipping as well because I just want all to, uh, you know, and all the texture all all the taste from the the broth and all the liquid ingredients that we add in is it will go into the chicken 
So, yun po yung ginagawa ko. That's why I keep on turning the chicken. But then, guys, uh, I leave it there as well to simmer. Ayan, for a while. Para po, mas, mas more mag-absorb pa po yung ating mga ingredients. And then, I'm go I did put in in the oven. So, ayan, guys, as you can see. Ayan, uh, I did put it in, in the oven, guys, for like 15 minutes. So, yan na nga guys, yung ating uh, final product, uh, as you can see. And uh, it's my apology. Uh, I'm so sorry, guys, but I didn't show you already how I take off the skin. Ayan. Um, but after like 5 minutes in the oven, I take off the skin, guys. Ayan. Um, anyway, uh, I, I plan to take it off before I put it in the oven, but I totally, I totally forget the time. So, I just take it off after 5 minutes. So, ayan, guys. And then I just uh, put some... Um, coriander powder and spring onions but then again it's all your choice what toppings or what uh garnish you're going to put in ayan po but if you're going to use a uh, coriander ayan yung fresh coriander or your spring onion it's really really good guys the smell is so nice i promise and guys thank you so much and i hope na nag enjoy po kayo and i hope that you learn something from too it's very easy and simple to do it but of course as you can see it's not as perfect uh, as you can see but yeah i'm so happy and i'm so proud na mas masarap po siya it's so tasty especially if you're going to simmer it longer ayan po masarap po siya and it's very tender as well you can taste the sourness and yung sweet it's it's a good blend of the honey and the vinegar and of course yung garlic together so ayan guys thank you so much maraming maraming salamat po uh, sa lagi nyong panonood ng aking mga updates and again guys i don't have silver or gold but the only thing i have is a prayer that the blessings of the lord will continually flow into your family and his divine protection will cover you in your entire family also guys and again guys thank you so much thank you for always watching all my updates and truly indeed that you are such a blessings to me guys so please please stay safe stay healthy stay cheerful and guys ugaliin po natin laging mag stretch if we could and um um yeah we just take it lightly everything that what happens in our lives guys so guys thank you so much cheers bye have a good day have a great 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 week guys thank you bye